Hi beauties and curls, it's Melissa Q. Welcome back. So today's video, I did promise that before I go into the top five of like my makeup and my skincare, which I posted a poll on Twitter and you guys made it, it was even. So I don't even know where to start. Comment down below and let me know the next top five, do you want skincare or do you want makeup? Because I am gonna go through my top five because I, last time I did it was like two years ago and that was around the fall time so i definitely want to do a spring and summer one just because it needs to be updated so if you are new i just want to welcome you and tell you what's up my name is melissa and don't forget to hit the subscribe button we have fun over here so yeah let's just jump right today's in. video is going to be my top five hair growth products these are the products that i promised down helps my hair grow now i have i've actually tried the Hair vitamins, my main choice. I'm taking prenatal vitamins. I don't know if those are working, to be honest with you, but I know that these work because I've used these in the past. So there's no secret that castor seed oil will help grow your lashes, your brows, your hair. So most of these products I wanna say contain castor oil, but I wanted to show you some affordable ones and ones that I have been loving for years. So the first product I'm gonna share with you guys is from the drugstore and I picked this up from Target. This is the Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil Strengthen and Grow and Restore Edge Treatment. I love this for my edges. Now it's gonna look like I did not use a lot but because it's extra thick, it smells just like the line, the whole line. You can definitely smell the Jamaican black castor oil in this, but I use this for my edges. I really do like this. A little bit goes a long way. And this is, it does, um, it's quite thick. So you wanna use this around your edges when you have your hair curly. This would revert your hair back, I believe, straight. So I would not put this in my hair right now just because it would make my edges too curly although my hair is straight. So I love using this when my hair is curly. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to talk to you guys about is, this is a product called Ojan. This is their hair treatment. I'm gonna list everything down below and you'll get to see it because the label is obviously gone. I've had this for a while, but it I love it, I love it. I actually used it today, so you can use it with your straight hair on your ends and you can also mix this in to your deep conditioner and you can also use this as a hot oil treatment. Now when you use this as a hot oil treatment, you wanna put it in a hot bowl. You don't wanna like actually stick this in the microwave because it will take all the nutrients out of the product. So I love this dropper. It's super duper lightweight. Those are high antioxidants and they have a lot of nutrients that help hair grow the hair and make it strong and healthy. They do have a deep conditioner that I love, a deep treatment that smells like coffee beans and it smells so good, but this is the oil and I absolutely love it. This is for my girls that like to cook in the kitchen. Yes, I'm from Mississippi, so I just had to say that because I love cooking in the kitchen. These are oils that you can pretty much find in your kitchen. Mine is the Jamaican black castor oil. You can find all of these in your kitchen. So I have olive oil in here. I have coconut oil. I have the Jamaican black castor oil with rosemary, which rosemary is great for um, strengthening the hair, which helps you retain length. So you just don't want something to grow your hair. You actually want something to strengthen it at the same time. That's why the Jamaican black castor oil that you can get from Target or from uh, CVS, I've also saw this at Walgreens, those type of stores, because it has the Jamaican black castor oil that helps grow the hair, but this also contains keratin, which helps strengthen it. So you want something that also strengthens your hair. And yeah, I absolutely love this. Um, I use this as my, in my lock method, and I also use it sometimes as a, a hot oil treatment and like I said you want to put this in a bowl but I really do love the concoction that I made and it has olive oil in it too that's really gonna moisturize the hair so make your own concoction if you know if you can't like if you feel like you can't go out of your pockets for something make your own concoction and try it and see if your hair really reverts 
to these. The next one I want to talk about is the Apple Sorghum Supple Hair Syrup. Now the first ingredient in this is castor seed oil and I've noticed like a lot of my products, my hair first of all loves castor oil. It loves castor oil, loves coconut oil, it loves avocado oil. Like find out what oils your hair really loves and then maybe add something to it. Now castor oil is known to grow the hair. Jamaican black castor oil is amazing for that. And so this I have been using for a while now. Um, my son, my oldest son, he's about to turn seven. When I had him around six months, my hair started falling out and it was crazy. But I did notice that I use this and the product that I'm about to talk to you guys about. But this Bacura apple and sorghum, I use this year round. I actually have two of these right here that I actually read up and you'll see these in a haul. And I also have uh, one in my bathroom. And I actually, I'm thinking I could actually use it for my brows if I wanted to grow my brows. But this is, I'm telling you, this is a hair growth serum to me. I mean, it's worked on my hair and I love using it on my curly hair. Now, this is a pretty heavy oil. If I were going to use this, I can actually put this in my deep conditioner, but I recommend not putting this on straight hair because it's so heavy. It may blade it up and um, may it, it may weigh it down a bit. So if you're going to use any on your hair while it's dry, I've used both of these. And um, when my hair is straight, I really do love this. I use this one with my curly hair and I use this in my deep conditioner. So I'm just y'all I'm sorry for being all over the place but yeah I just want to give you as much information for hair growth as possible now just recently it this is in my straight state but I'm actually about to wash my hair I cut off uh, quite a bit of hair and I did that because my hair looked raggedy and I wanted to kind of like do a do-over after having Joseph he's my two-year-old and my hair has been shedding and and like crazy and so I'm going back to a lot of products that I have been using in the past that's really helped my hair grow and this one oh my goodness when I was pregnant with Elijah and my hair started falling out like it is now and actually my hair is a lot worse now um joseph was a twin and so maybe that had some things going on with my hormones because it went from 1000 to zero and yeah it, it just is crazy but my hair is growing back but it looks like a troll yes the edges and everything but it is growing back and that's what matters but the niacin intensive therapy hair booster y'all this blew my hair like a weed i kid you not now not Kiana, who is my natural hairstylist that actually does both my hair curly and natural, but my previous hairstylist before that told me about this when I was going through with Elijah and y'all, my hair grew like a weed. So I was like, what things, let me go back to some of the things my hair is shedding. So I used to do hair tea rinses and I need to go back to that. Let me go back to my hair growth my hair booster now I'm going to look more into Nioxin this is the only product that she recommended and I went out and got it and this grow grew my hair I did pick mine up off of Amazon I will leave a link down below but I absolutely love this it grew my hair my hair really doesn't do anything too much that I can see a significant change with hair vitamins but this and black castor seed oil I would say the, these have been the most effective products that I have used and this is so so good so I highly recommend these so I hope you guys enjoyed my top five hair growth products I am gonna come with some reviews and some hairstyles and um, some hair tutorials let me know down in the comments what you guys want to see next in terms of makeup and skincare I did post a poll on Twitter and you guys it was a tie so have you guys want to see top five skincare top five makeup Do you guys want to see skincare next or makeup in the top five so i hope you guys enjoyed this don't forget to give it a thumbs up comment down below let me know what you have used in the past that has grown your hair i would love to hear and i'm sure everybody else would too this is a community that i definitely want it to be helpful and uplifting but also share what is working for us and what's not because sometimes finding out what you love is finding out what you don't like as well so I love you guys and I will see you in the next few days in another video.